Hello there and good afternoon. There are reports that a cross-party group of MPs, including former ministers, is going to try and take control of the parliamentary agenda next week in order to then take control of the Brexit process. This plot is reported to have come to light when the Tory chief whip Julian Smith overheard it in the Commons cloakroom. This news is said to have shell-shocked the Prime Minister and her top aides. Normally, the government, which is usually formed by the largest party, would decide what business would be debated in Parliament. But these backbench MPs are planning to put forward an amendment that would change a rule that has been in force since the 1800s to make sure that the government ran the agenda, to then give motions proposed by backbenchers priority over any put forward by the government. This would fundamentally change how the UK Parliament and indeed our whole democratic process would function. To do this, they would of course need a Speaker of the House that would be amenable to this amendment being put forward for a vote. And as we've already seen, Speaker John Burko is not averse to rocking the constitutional boat where Brexit is concerned. He's already broken with centuries of convention by allowing an amendment put forward by Dominic Grieve last week that now forces the PM to go back to Parliament within three days of losing her meaningful vote, which is due next Tuesday. Burko did this claiming that it was his job to give more power and say to backbench MPs, so this next move could get his support and, as others have said, where Commons procedures are concerned, the Speaker's word is law. And according to the Express, the Speaker, whose relationship with the government has collapsed, would select the motion for a vote. Couple this with claims that he and Grieve met in secret just prior to Burko allowing Grieve's motion, and you can tell where this is leading. The Express also quotes an unnamed senior government figure as saying that this could be game over for Brexit, while another said it sounds like a very British coup that has profound implications for democracy. Be in no doubt, this could actually make the country ungovernable, as the backbenches could put up motion after motion to stop any government motion seeing the light of day. On top of that, Parliament could then pass a law that would make it illegal for the UK to leave the EU without a deal, or even pass a law to reverse Brexit altogether. At the end of the day, the Remainers are intent on doing all they can to make the UK ungovernable unless it is governed from Brussels. And as I've pointed out before, the Remainers have to continually destroy the UK constitution and our democratic processes in order to achieve it. And for that, they should never be forgiven. Now is the time for all Brexiteers out there to support, vote for and join UKIP. Anyway, what do you think? Please leave a comment below and thank you for watching.